Hi everyone, it's Lorraine. It is Sunday night and I am just hopping on here. Pretty random, unannounced. Um, so, I don't know if anybody's going to be hopping on here with me. Um, I will give it just a minute to see if anybody joins in. Uh, tonight, I just, I actually just wanted to hop on and really show you how easy it is to remove makeup. I talk all the time about putting it on, but I want to show you how easy it is to take it off. I was getting ready to take my uh, makeup off for the night. Unlike the rest of my household, I have to go to work tomorrow. So um, a lot of people have off for the holiday tomorrow, but I will be going to work. So just trying to plan out my week like I do on a Sunday night. I just came from a lovely dinner with my hubby and my brother and sister-in-law. And my makeup has been on pretty much all day. I have not done anything to touch it up. Um, my lashes still, you can see. I'm hoping you can see. Uh, still look pretty, pretty much like when I put them on. And I just have very minimal um, makeup on today <clears throat> but before I do before I go ahead and um, show you the shine wipes which um, I use almost every night they're actually not even wipes they're like a cloth they're really thick they're super super soft and they're amazing they're not only great at taking off your makeup but they're actually good for your skin um, but I'll get to them in a moment in a minute um, so sunflower oil olive uh, jojoba vitamin E and rosemary so they're really good good and nourishing for your skin I love it I love it better than doing um, actually using a face wash um, at night so anyway I wanted to also show you um, what I've been using to fight the dilemma that I have with my dry lips. And I think I've showed this in the past, but again, this is like my saving grace. It's the Lip Exfoliator, and it's a sugar scrub with shea butter. And it's actually gritty, and it tastes really good. So if you get, if you do get it in your mouth it tastes good it tastes like sugar but I'll show you if you put this on I like to put it on actually when I am starting my makeup I let it stay on just kind of massage it into your lips and it exfoliates them so I'll usually leave that on do my makeup and then you can wipe it off rinse it off with some warm water or actually I just usually take a tissue and wipe it off. Um, and then it makes your lips really soft. It takes off all that dead skin. And if you go to apply any kind of lipstick or um, I'm going to show you the liquid lipstick in the one of the splash colors, one of my favorites, and it is the Sentimental. And it's a great winter color. I'm going to try and put this on for you you just need a really little bit too that's the thing it comes out on this little wand and you just need a little bit now I'm gonna look in the mirror up here make sure I got all that scrub off my lips but this is a really really pretty one of my new favorites um, for winter lips so I'll put it on I'm not good at talking to you while I'm doing this so give me just a minute here and you need just a little bit. And this is matte. So it's um, really, really pretty. You only need a little bit. And it lasts. It stays on a long time. Alright, not sure how my lines are. Because if you ever tried to put this on, 
not close to a mirror, it's kind of difficult. So let's see if the lighting can pick this up a little better. I'll try and play with it here a minute. So it's super smooth because I use my lip exfoliator so I don't have any dry skin or cracks. You can see. Can you see that? And the thing about the liquid lipsticks is they stay on. So they stay on a really long time. Now it's not like the lip stains where they're not going to come off when you drink and things like that. It will come off. But I can put this on in the morning and it stays on until lunchtime at least, um, until I start, you know, really eating and drinking something. So there you go. I just wanted to show you that. Um, and now I can show you how to take it all off. Mm, I have it on my teeth too, but, um, again, my lashes are from hours ago and that is just one coat. Hopefully you can see that. And there you have it. So a quick cure for the winter dry chap lips. Um, the shine wipes, like I said, full of good, good things uh, to help your skin. And I'm going to show you how easy it does come off. Now I just put the lips on. I hate to take them off. And it might be a little difficult since they're just on there. But... Okay, so with when you have the mascara on or any mascara on, especially if you have eyeliner on, just kind of take the cloth. Now, see, this is oh, and it smells really good. Um, so just take the cloth and hold it on your eye, okay? So I just usually hold it on there for a couple seconds. And then once I do that, then I can just wipe. Okay, you can see all that it's taken off. Now I would do the rest of my face. I'm only going to show you one side, so you can see one side with and one side without. What a difference the makeup makes. And it's really, really minimal. You're going to see the red blotches that I have on my skin that are hidden. Let me take a tissue and get some of this. feel like I'm a kid with crayons. I'm going back to my clown days. So if any of you don't know it, back in my former life, I was a clown at children's birthday parties. I've talked about that before too. So um, I wish I had these shine wipes back then. All right, so I want to show you Taking half of this off, you're going to see the redness in my skin because I do have a lot of different color pigmentation until I put that um, liquid foundation, the touch liquid foundation on. You're going to see the coloring in my skin. Okay. So can you see the difference? One side that still has the makeup. You can see the difference here. Look at how bad my discoloration of my skin and my eyebrow. I barely have one here. Hi, Lynn. Lynn, I'm so full from dinner. But look at the difference in just the eyebrow. I think this week I'll do a quick, um, a quick video just to show you uh, how easy it is to do eyebrows too because it really takes me just a minute to do that. So there you go. Half still with the makeup. Half without. Huge difference. It doesn't even look like the same skin. Um, and look at this cloth. I could still, well, I'll still be able to do the other half of my face with this. There's still a lot of life left in that. All right, guys. That is my little tip for tonight. Um, hopped on unexpectedly, but I hope that you get to watch this 
as always thank you for being here please uh, like my page makeup stat if you haven't already and please um, share share the video I would so much appreciate that all right have a great night have a great week and I will be back soon thanks again for watching and I will talk to you later bye